Jess here with Bless Jess. Thank you so much for watching today. I have all my stuff back here. Um, welcome. I, if you're new around here, hi, I'm Jess. I'm so happy that you chose to watch this video. Craziness goes on in my house in the background all the time, so I'm sorry. <laughs> I've got dogs barking back there and Lucy's talking, but welcome. I am so excited to be a part of this collaboration. This is the finished four by the fourth collaboration. Um, awesome ladies involved. I just want to thank them. Thank you, Miss Gina, for letting me be a part. Everybody will be, I believe, linked down below, so go check out everyone. Disclaimer, I am not a high-end makeup I wish I was um, person. I am on a tight budget with my makeup. I love makeup. I love it. But, you know, it's a luxury that, <laughs> you know, we as moms sometimes have a hard time buying stuff for ourselves. At least I know I do. So I try to find the best deals I can. And drugstore usually is where I go. So I have, and I love this, the thought of trying to finish four of my makeup or whatever different products by a certain amount of time because how many of us have a drawer full of stuff you know and it just takes up space I know I do and then it finally gets expired and you throw it away and it's like well that was a waste of money so I'm so excited to be a part of this collaboration and to be telling you guys what I'm going to be telling you guys in this video what my four items are and then I'll be updating you periodically and letting you know how it's going as I try to finish them up by is it July 4th I think I'm terrible at this kind of stuff y'all details details so I'm gonna drink my water I'm gonna tell you my four items um the first thing now I am a if I could say one thing about like what makeup products I typically hoard <laughs> it would be foundations you guys can tell I am super fair like the fairest fair it's always very easy for me to find my shade because I just go to the very fairest shade they have and that's me. And sometimes it's still too dark. So I have a lot of foundations and you know, they're not good forever. Right now, I believe I have three or four foundations open at a time. It's just so stupid, I shouldn't do that. So one of my items that I'm gonna be trying to finish up is this L'Oreal, and it's probably not gonna focus because that is also my life. Um, the L'Oreal True Match. See, it's not gonna focus on me if I hold it up against my fair skin. Anyway, this is a L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Makeup. And this is the, uh, the Cool Alabaster. Fairest fair they have. And I am more cool toned. If you're not familiar with these, these foundations are awesome. And they have warm shades and they have cool shades. I'm definitely more... Sorry guys. Um, I'm definitely more cool toned and so I'm the coolest fair. So this one I would say is at least halfway full and I've had it for just maybe a month and I really want to focus on this and get it finished up so I can move on to my other foundations that I have open. This is one of my favorites. I've bought it multiple times and I really wish it would focus but I'm sure you guys know um, you've seen it before but this is only like it's less than ten dollars and it's awesome and it's very breathable and lightweight but it has really great coverage so my first item that I'm trying to finish up is the L'Oreal true match um the next one is kind of like a two for one I love getting what is it called ipsy ipsy bags and these both I think actually one of these might have come in a birch box they have two Hikari I think I'm saying that right. Cream eyeshadows. Now, my other favorite love is eyeshadows. I love eyeshadows because I guess you can, you know, you can play around with them and have fun. I have both of these on right now, and you probably can't tell because it's kind of washed out here in this light. But these are cream eyeshadows, and I know that those are, they don't last as long as regular eyeshadows. So I want to try to use these up, and I'm going to show you the colors. I love these. These are awesome, and I love just being able to put it on my fingers and just kind of rubbing it around. Um, the first one is a very good, for me, a very good, like, I'm not good with technical makeup terms, but it's a very good, like, base to put all over everything, and it's just really shimmery, and it's really pretty, and this is, like, a very, it's almost, like, pearlescent, neutrally highlight, kind of. It's not really a highlight on me because I'm so fair, but it's a very good, it's a very good all over color. And this is called Honeydew. This one is my favorite. I've been wearing it all, 
all uh, for the last two weeks. I've been wearing it like every single day. I really want to finish this up. And if I can finish this up in the next few months, I'm going to purchase a full size of this because these are both just samples, but it's pretty big size samples. So, I mean, I've been using it for weeks. I still haven't hit pan on it. So that's my, that one. And then I like to put this one on top of it. This is called Latte. Ah, it's going to be harder to finish up because it's very pigmented. It only takes a little tiny bit. But it's really pretty. It's kind of like a goldish brown. And I like to just put that on the lids. And it's really pretty. And I love these cream eyeshadows because they just blend so well. And they, they just, they're awesome. So that counts as one item because it's two in one, y'all. Hikari. Like I'm saying it right. Honeydew Latte. We're going to finish these up. Um, oh, I feel like I'm forgetting one. I might, I think I have one more, so I, I'm, I might have to pause this in a second. This is a sad little thing. Oh yeah, I do have one more. I, I know exactly what it is too. This is a sad thing <laughs> because I've lost the lid to this. This is like one of my favorite lipsticks and it's so cheap. It is the Wet n Wild dark pink frost it's what i have on my lips right now it is so pretty i don't know if it's just i think it's also my skin tone it just is very flattering it's a very pinky frosted you guys i have two or three of these in my cabinet right now um it's so funny because anytime there's a sell on wet and wild i'll just pick up one like i can get them almost free with coupons and so i'll just pick up a lipstick without really even looking at it and i've bought like two or three and not even realizing it's the same shape because i love it so much this is how much i have left so I definitely think I can use that up. Although it takes a long time to use this. It just, it, I don't know why. Um, these are like a dollar and I love them. So <laughs> I'm going to be finishing this sad little lipstick with no top. Mom life. And um, so I can get to the other <laughs> ones with the lids. But if you haven't tried this, it is so... It's not going to focus. But it is so pretty. I haven't touched that. Okay. Hang on one second. Let me go get that other one. Okay, sorry y'all. Um, <clears throat> I put this up after I got ready. I also have all of these items on my face today. So it's just to start it off. So this last one is a concealer. Concealers are also really hard for me because I'm so fair that most concealers are way too dark. This one I've had forever and I really need to get you get it gone out of my life because I have so many, I have actually one or two other concealers that have like sticks and it's just so much easier to like dab it on, rub it in and I'm gone. Also, hashtag mom life, I don't have a lot of time for makeup. Like I just have to put it on and go. So this one doesn't have a, <laughs> a little applicator and so it never gets used. But this is a, a really awesome concealer that I need to use and they paid a lot of money for it. Not a lot, but I paid a little bit of money for it. So this is the, um, who makes it? I believe it was Maybelline. It's all rubbed off. The Maybelline Master Conceal Camouflage camouflaging concealer and this is in fair obviously this is a super duper high coverage so like somebody's knocking on the door concealer it's very thick it only takes a little bit so it's going to be another challenge to get through but i think i can it's it's really it's like there and everything else is empty so i've had it for probably a year i need to get i need it maybe is expired but i need to get going on this so that's my number four item and I do have a bonus item okay this is not a makeup product but it is something that I need to commit to getting rid of um these are vitamins now I am not pregnant I am not pregnant but these are prenatal vitamins <laughs> and this is something I've had since I was uh, nursing Lucy a year ago and they expire in July so I don't want to waste these things. These are good vitamins. And um, actually when I take these, even when I'm not pregnant, because I feel like the prenatal vitamins make me feel awesome. They're just really strong vitamins. And um, I really like them. But the problem is, for whatever reason, I never take vitamins. Like I, I, ha I never remember. The only ones I remember to take are like the chewable, like gummy ones, because I can just throw them in and after I'm done for the day, I will do those. But for whatever reason, these, I'm like, Oh, well, I don't, I forgot to take, I mean, I never can remember. So I thought I counted these out. And if I take one every day, I will definitely get them all finished by July 4th. So I need to put this in here. So I will remember to take them and use these up before they expire. I'm not pregnant. You guys, <laughs> I promise you, but, um, 
you know, I, I don't like wasting stuff. If I bought it, especially something that makes me feel good when I take it, I need to use it. So those are my four makeup items, my one vitamin item. I know this probably isn't very super exciting items, but it is stuff that I like. I, I have it all on right as I as I talk to you I have it all on my face right now and um, it's all stuff that's flattering I like it and I have other things I need I need to use up these so I can get to the other things and not end up having to throw these away so that is my little uh, beginning start to this finish four by the fourth again everyone else will be linked down below go check them all out i can't wait to see all of their items that they're doing and they're probably gonna be way more exciting than mine <laughs> but anyway thank you all so much for watching if you like this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up leave a comment down below please subscribe if you're new and i'll talk to you guys in a few weeks bye y'all